Noreen and welcome to my kitchen. Today we have a really quick tip. I don't know how many of you know how easy it is to peel ginger, but when you get ginger like this, you know, don't take your paring knife and try and peel it because it's really difficult to do it that way. I have a super easy way. Take a spoon. This is just a plain old eating spoon. Turn it upside, you know, turn it over and then just start gently scraping the outer part of the skin off the ginger. And this is really helpful because it helps you go over the rough surfaces of the ginger and then you can end up with a really nice smooth piece. And what you can do is even get these tiny little pieces but sometimes you might not want to. I like to buy the smaller pieces of ginger because I think they're more flavorful and they're more moist and they're less dried out, which is kind of redundant to say, but you know, oh well. Sometimes when you buy ginger, um, they, they can tend to be dried out. But yeah, that's how you cook, cook, that's how you peel ginger. The other great part about using the spoon is that it easily helps you navigate over these really bumpy parts of the ginger and voila quick and easy and that's how you do it so i hope that's helpful i hope you learned something hope you try it hope you love it till next time i'll see ya thank you for joining me in my kitchen today i hope you like what you watched today and i hope that you try it and i hope that you love it uh, if you like what you saw please consider hitting the thumbs up button and giving me a positive rating and also make sure that you hit the subscribe button if you're already not a subscriber so that you don't miss out on any of the fun we have here in our kitchen every single day you can also follow me on facebook and twitter and pinterest and instagram and google plus and blogger i have a blog over there and you can take a look at that you can um, subscribe to that feed as well and don't forget that Every recipe that you see me um, do here on YouTube, with the exception of a few earlier ones, you can access all of the recipes over on my website, noreenskitchen.com, where you will find printer-friendly versions of those recipes so you can print them out and keep them for your own. So, I hope that you enjoyed it. I'm really glad that you're here. Thank you for stopping by. Don't forget to come by tomorrow. Until next time, happy eating!